Neuroscience is the study of probably the most unique organ on the planet, the human brain. What does it mean to be a human person? And then what does it mean to live the good life as a result of understanding that? Where a vast majority of the work is right now is helping cure neurodegenerative disease. Parkinson's disease, Alzheimer's disease, and our National Institute of Health has been pouring money into trying to understand these diseases. There is a, a lot of hope for discovery that can really impact somebody's life. It's very easy for an undergraduate student to get involved in research. One of my more recent grads is, is working with one of the top spinal surgeons in the country. And because of his experience doing research here, he was able to just work his way right into that lab. A majority of my students go on to med school, but I had a physics student who is working for Tesla. We've had philosophy students, and we've had folks from the Bible and theology department come in and really press us hard to be precise about how we're talking about what it means to be a human person. A student in our conservatory here took one of my classes and did a project on the neuroscience of music therapy, and this whole world was opened up. She had a passion for both music and science and she was able to combine them in a way that she just hadn't seen possible before being here. Any student that is just curious about themselves and the way that they work is going to be really well positioned to study the brain. Faith and science can coexist really well. The unique thing about coming to Wheaton to study neuroscience is the integrative nature of it. You are going to learn about how your brain works and how the cells work and how the neural circuits work, but we won't stop there. We will also teach you about your spirit and your soul and how that might interact with your brain to make you who you are. And so I hope that we're putting students out into the world that can answer the big neuroscientific questions but then can also challenge their colleagues and their audiences to think deeper and to think more carefully about what it means to be a human person.